Thursday 27th of June 2019 is a day that remains exceptionally special. For a long time in the minds of 74 special individuals, their family members and the staff of Day Waterman College of Yokuta, Nigeria, as it was on this day that they honorably scaled the milestone of graduating college at a well-attended and prestigious valedictory service held at the school premises. The graduating class of 2019, a round of applause for them. Can you please put your hands together for them till they get to their seats? They're looking so amazing this morning, and they are deserving of all the plaques and awards that have been handed to them. The students were visibly beaming with joy and appropriate pride, and guess who else who were proud of them? Their parents, guardians, and notable guests, including Senator Farouk Bello, Governor of Imo State, Emeka Ehed Yoha, the Principal, Mr. Stewart Cowden, Chairman Board of Governors, Mr. Olua Tufarati Agostu, Co-Founder of De Watermark College, Mrs. Aderinoku, Popular Gospel Singer, Tokwa Alabi, Mr. Christopher Jagede, board members and several distinguished guests. Now young boys and girls, let me congratulate you for passing through one of the best secondary schools in our country. But let me charge you that the task of nation building now lies also on your laps. Let me encourage you that if you believe by the grace of God, you will make it. So I urge you now to take the book by the hand and realize that your parents have done what they can do for you. The rest is yours. The guest speakers, Nato Farouk Bello, acknowledge the excellent quality of education obtainable in the Day Waterman College and discourage studying abroad. For the graduates, you have today demonstrated your preparedness to go into the future of endless opportunities. Now, please all children, take a minute to reflect on the sacrifices that your parents made. So please parents, don't get tired. I know it means a lot to us, but at the end of the day, the children will justify the sacrifice that you made on them. What Waterman now is doing excellently well. Why do we need to take our children outside this country? Why don't we continue with this spirit? The De Waterman College Choir and Koshara Group showed in several ways how much the school values religion and the arts. The high point of the valedictory service was the introduction of the valedictorian of the class of 2019, beautiful and lovely Miss Anthony Sawyer Marika Oluwa Tuminino. The chairman, sir, Faridi, to officially announce valedictorian for the class of 2019, Miss Mika Oluwa Tuminino.
the last five years went by so incredibly fast. It seems like not long ago was September 20th, 2014, our first day at Waterman College, for most of us anyways. We were having our first night. Some of us cried, some of us pretended as if we didn't feel like crying. And that was five, four years ago, to the graduating class of 2019. Our stay in this school hasn't been easy by any means. When we came here seven, there was the Ebola crisis, election, mini cyclone that made me afraid of wind for like two years, the second election that required Saturday school, among other challenges. But despite numerous setbacks, together we were able to overcome all the barriers as a whole. Looking back on year 11, my most memorable moments had to do with all of you. I asked her what she wanted to do. She said she wanted to stop messing. It will be the pleasure of the government of Limo State to adopt her as our daughter. And we will be glad to have her on our scholarship. All in all, it was indeed a great day for the Day Waterman College, the students and their families. So I'm a coach reporting for it to Cosmic Studios. Of yours and continue around for you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen.